grand finals of uh, Summer Smash, whatever, I don't know what it's called. We have Machu versus Jimmer. Machu rocking his uh, new main, Roy, which he's been pretty much tearing up everybody today. And uh, Jimmer playing Cloud. I have it all recording. Glitch in my capture card. Oh, what glitch? If you go here, you turn on the audio. Oh. You need to do that every time for some reason. But So I just talked for no reason. No, it, it picked up the mic audio. Okay. Oh, Why do you not? It doesn't pick up the game on. with the pop -up. Okay. You got it. He had it first. Yeah. He started it. All right. Jimmer vs. Machu. Recording's all set up. They opt. They opt to just go to Smashville. All right. So this will be interesting. Uh... Matt did take out Jimmer. He is in winners. He did take out Jimmer um, with Jimmer using his secondaries. But let's see. He has been known to get over because these they're very even. But hmm. Why is he playing Roy? Uh, it's his new main. He's basically been working on Roy all day, and he's been winning. He won a tournament with Roy. So they're pretty even. Uh, Matt has been known though to use weird characters in this matchup. So. I mean, he, he used Ganondorf one time infamously at uh, our FanCon tournament. Jimmer's, Jimmer's putting on the pressure. Down smashes the shield. Goes for down throw Nair, but can't connect it. Jimmer's up in the air. Uh, misses the up air. Forward tilt. Gets another grab. Tries to keep connecting that Nair, but I don't think it's going to. Jimmer's CI. B reverses off stage and recovers. That was tricky. Oh, tries to spot dodge Cloud's forward smash. Doesn't quite work, though. Cloud's forward smash is redonkulous. Down smash will not take the stock. Jimmer does not have limit, though. Okay, that was weird. Weird movement from Matt trying to recover. I assume trying to weeble wobble over to the ledge, but... Fails! Okay, how's he going to get him? I think he was trying to counter his up B, but it didn't quite get the timing down. Despite how easy the counter is, it's... I mean, you gotta get some timing down. Gets it down, but Jimmer snaps the ledge quick enough. Up air. You cannot challenge that. Forward smash! The Roy... The Roy baseball bat, essentially. Okay, oh. Oh. All right, so just playing footsies, Matt, at 106. But Roy with Rage is a very scary monster. Gets the down throw into Jen, or into forward tilt, but recovers. He's on 120%. Getting very close into up throw range. Does that for some reason. Mind Games XD. Up air will not seal it somehow. 140, though. I'm pretty sure another up air or anything Cloud can do will take it. Oh, gets the down throw into four. Counters. But Roy's... But, the comeback. But Cloud's dead, I suppose. <laughs> that is one up for Machu, who's in losers. Uh, I better put that, who's in losers. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Okay, deciding what they're going to do next. Um, I don't know. Honestly, in this matchup, I'm not sure. I guess lower ceilings would probably be it. Uh, things to exploit Roy, not having as much range as Cloud in this matchup. Because that's a big thing. Is Basically, Roy is, you know... He is, he is Cloud's power, but just Cloud has so much more range and speed in a lot of ways. And Roy has his base, so his base tipper. Oh, up tilt. He's reading. Down tilt. Gets forward smash, though. 19%. Jim Renair training him. Oh, my God. And a forward tilt, putting him at 57% already. That was a weird attack on shield that did not get punished. Okay. Jimmer gets back up. Tries to read his get on with an up smash. I don't... 
I don't think he's just going to fall into that, though. <laughs> Goes for the cheeky counter. Doesn't quite get it, though. <laughs> Dash attack. Ooh, goes for the forward smash read, but can't quite get it. Down smash him, we're reading it. Roll back. Almost seals the stock. Nair, though, will. He does not have a jump. Magnet hands will not save him in that situation. <laughs> tries to read the tries, tries to read the scrub roll, but doesn't quite get it. Ooh. Man, rolls down smashes. He needs to take this. Down tilt. That will seal the stock. That weak hit was... Wow, interesting. That was emphatic. That was amazing. Alright, going in. Nair train, baby. Nair train. Clanking with up tilt. Jimmer spacing himself. Gets under him. Gets with that side B. Goes in. Ooh, blocks that down air. Forward air. Off stage. Tries to get him with the neutral B. Doesn't quite get it. Down smashed off stage. Ooh. Manages to clank. Close. Manages to clank with the down air. Jimmer does have his limit though. So he cannot be gimped. And he has kill options. And that will be the kill. That is one up for Jimmer in this set. I think this is it. Is it? No, this isn't. Eh, I won't worry about it. Okay. So, from the sounds of it, Matt is... Oh, he's switching his, his next new main. Mr. Game & Watch. Aren't they both going to lose this? Huh? Nope. Then why is Matt going to lose Well, Matt's from loser side. That's just why I put it. Isn't he? Or no? No, he's no. not. I'm retarded. He's from, he's from Winner's side, dude. Yep. I'll fix that. Remember, he was against, uh, Sam was against, uh, Jimmer. Jimmer's in Losers. Jimmer's a loser. Uh, I don't get it. Excellent commentary. Okay. Man, the Game & Watch. Weird matchup. He's getting those two toots. Down smash, doesn't quite get it. Jimmer rolls for the grab, but gets jabbed. <laughs> the taunt! <laughs> Who says Game & Watch doesn't have good taunts? Oh, down throw, this might be... Oh. Forward tilted off. Game & Watch does have a pretty decent recovery, though. Coming back, does the tournament winner back on stage and gets up smashed. That raw up smash. That dash tag. Oh my god, getting kicked in the chops. He's back on stage. Luckily, he doesn't do tournament winner. Gets him off. Jimmer's recovering. Back air by Machu, though. Who doesn't get the 2 2? Jimmer has. He uses it on shield. Oh. The cheeky taunts. Alright, so... Game of Watch is up with Rage. But anything at this moment will kill him. Not a back air, though. Gets back. Facing with the back air. Trying to get something. Probably trying to connect with the up air. Oh, gets the last hit on Reed there with the down smash, taking the stock. All right, Jimmer sealed it with only zero. He's back. He's getting too tooted though. Cloud's trying to land. Gets that nicked up air. He has limit though. See how he uses it. I would probably just save it at this point. So uh, he doesn't get gimped. Ooh, forward. Forward smash. Or forward B. Doesn't quite get it. All right, let's go. Back air on shield. Jimmer trying to get out of this pressure. Down airs. Matthew doesn't challenge it. Jimmer goes down. Down air. Back air out of shield. Looking for something. Gets the grab. Forward throws it. Reads the roll in with a down smash. Trying to play very safe. Game watches. 
Honestly, I'm surprised I haven't seen any RNG hammers. I'm assuming that Matt is uh, is saving it up. Either that or he's not going to go for... Ooh, this is going to be a gimp. Oh my god. The disrespect. L-M-A-O XD. Game and Watch. Machu up 2-0. Or 2-1, sorry. That was just rude. One more, oh, and he's boy. in thirty-nine dollars. Thirty-nine dollars he gets. Oh boy! Oh boy! That is a good deal. That is a well. I mean, pay five dollars to enter and win a bunch with Roy. That's a pretty good deal. Come on with forty bucks. He just took free money. <laughs> took everybody's money. Took my money. Yeah, that's fair. Ari's back with that young gaming watch. Four there. Okay, what was I doing? Got distracted. Gets that immaculate. Um, I think that was back throw? Yeah, that was back throw. Or no, down throw, whatever. Half of Cloud's throw send him behind. Okay, low ceiling. They will be able to kill each other, but 2 2 is going to be pretty strong as well as Cloud's uh, up air. The giant green bar. Gimps are gonna be real. Oh my goodness. Machu is just living it up, living the game and watch life. He got down smash though. So if he loses, he's I mean, what are you gonna say? Gets the PM up B connection. Down smash, trying to read each other. Juma gets the grab. Down throws. Gets a back air. Doesn't quite kill. Charges up limit though. He's able to kill. Oh, sneak into the ledge. The cloud sneak. Nice. Down smash on the seal. Dreamer reads it and gets the forward B limit break. Dreamer's got to keep this momentum. Two, two will take the stock. 8%. This is Dreamer's tournament stock. Down throw. Doesn't connect because that's not true. Oh, up air, the, up air that lasts a million years. Nair, forward tilt. Oh, he's going. Go the, it's uh, the side B. No. Jimmer is a lot about confirms, mostly. Aside from the down throw forward B. Machu at 80%. Jimmer has has his limit. Oh, he goes for the cheeky RNG hammer. Doesn't quite get it, though. Brings out limit. All right, let's see. Spacing with forward air. Tries to challenge the down air. Can't do it. Last hit of forward smash will take it. All right. That is 2-2. Two, two. Will Jimmy reset the bracket? Or will Machu win? So Jimmer has... Or Machu has had new mains today. So I'm wondering. What does he do? Oh, he's changing the tag. Wait. Wait, what is this? Who? Hey, could this be? Oh. Okay, you see, the interesting thing about this is that at the recent FanCon tournament, Machu was down a lot of games, but managed to bring it back with his uh, quote-unquote Manendorf. This is an interesting matchup. Jimmer does not like this matchup uh, in pretty much every game. Uh, I assume not so much melee because he has Sheik and Sheik destroys him, but in PM and in Smash 4, the Ganondorf, the Manendorf. Jadorf. All right. Now, I will, I will admit because I have beaten the top clouds, or a top cloud at least, with my Manendorf. So, this is a matchup that 90% of the time is absolutely god-awful for Ganondorf. And that small 10%, that is, that is the true... I don't know. Sometimes Jadorf can wreck Cloud. That's basically it. Depends all on the flubbery. Yeah, it depends all on the reeds and the flubbery. Down there's a shield. Gets grabbed, though. Untrue side B. Gets his own side B. Down tilt... Ooh, tries to challenge that. Four, how does that 45%? <laughs> uh, 
he's Machu has gotten like two actual hits on him, and he's actually 45%. Gets the raw forward smash though. Jimmer not in out of this yet. I think honestly though, if Jimmer just plays smart, he can easily take this. Oh, up B on stage. Yeah, that was a good spacing move. All right. Up rolls on. Oh yeah, it's good, dude. Up B can up B can work. It's all about mix-ups. Oh, was that a footstool? Oh my goodness. I mean, Reading him. There's you with your signature hunter special with the falcon. We won't mention that. My falcon is fraudulent now. It, it's put in fraudulent status. But anyways. Oh, it doesn't quite get the... Tries to read the forward smash. Jimmer is one stock away from resetting the bracket. To break his Manendorf curse. He's off stage. I'll the edge guard him. Down tilt. Doesn't snap to ledge. Up B on stage. Ganondorf can't do much to punish it. Jimmer just has to play it safe if he wants to take this. Ooh, kind of manages to break the up B. Jab off stage. Jimmer's coming back, though. Oh, it doesn't quite get the two-frame punish that he wanted. Oh, reads the roll with a down smash. 140%. I am not sure how this man is not dead, but he's living. 155. Oh, gets... All right. Reads the tech. Dash tech. 27%. Jimmer is on tournament stock. But he's also one stock away from resetting the bracket. And all he has to do is take out a Ganondorf. You were playing it safe. Machu trying to get in with really the only ways Ganondorf can is side B and dash attack. And down B is a lot less safe. Up B, Ganondorf at 93%. It's close. But Ganondorf with Rage, two hits, and he's and Cloud could be dead. Spacing with those down airs. Gets grabbed. Doesn't tech it. Oh, gets the down tilted into forward air. He's off stage. He has limit, though. Ops to go for it on stage. Back air. Takes it. And ridiculous fashion. Machu takes it. Shadorf. Shadorf. A fraudulent dick. Sad face.